All right, so we're going to finish up the complete uh, truck front end overhaul. One of the, I guess, problems, it's not really a problem, just, you know, another modification we're going to have to do is, let's see here, on my stock F-150, it's got a front camera, and you can see here on this grill, there's not a front camera port so what I'm gonna have to do is I'm gonna have to cut out this section here and then kind of fit from behind let's get the focus the camera like that so we're gonna have to do a little modification like I said I'm gonna have to do a couple drilling a little sanding and then we got some plastic weld so yeah I'm gonna show you how to add a front camera to your Ford Raptor grill all right, let's get started. Hopefully I don't mess up this grill. Alright, so here's the test fit after I did some, I guess, cutting with the Dremel. I did have to just kind of put a screw right in there just to kind of keep this piece from moving. Uh, let's see here. You could trim from here to here, but I really didn't want to modify this bracket too much in case I ever, for whatever reason, have to go back to stock. So I'm going to take it out. You can see the test fit if you trim if you go little by little you shouldn't have to use too much plastic adhesion but you can see here took out the middle part of the honeycomb and then I trimmed right in there so that way this piece right there will fit snug so this is what it looks like from the back and I'll show you what it looks like with the camera in the front so here I'll show you pop it in there like that Pop it in there, snug, and then I'll flip it to the front so you can see. And that's what it looks like in the front. So let's kind of pan out a little bit. I think that looks good. So, next step is I'm going to use this plastic bonder. Since it's kind of got like a charcoal gray finish. I don't know if it comes in any other color, but I would recommend using black just so you don't have to do any painting or anything like that. So I'm going to try this. It says it. Let's see. It says strength up to 3,700 pounds. Sets in 15 minutes. You can sand it in 30 minutes and dries in black. So that's the next step I'll be doing. Alright, got it all mixed up. So, let's start putting it on the grill and hopefully this goes alright. set so I'm gonna let it cure for 30 minutes and we'll see what it looks like a few moments later all right 
right guys here's the final product you can see there's the camera right there and I think it looks pretty close to stock you can see there and it's in there good you can push on it do whatever that's not going anywhere let's pan out a little bit yeah it looks pretty close to stock so that's how you install a front camera to your grill if you got all right guys catch you on the next one